Sometimes timing is everything, and the timing seems to be just about right for drivers traveling along Lindale Avenue. Thanks to a traffic flow project that was given the green light back in 2009, which included purchase of new technology in traffic signal timing, motorists will notice little to no wait times at stoplights on Lindale Avenue. We took a ride with Bloomington City civil engineer Tom Bolin to see if this good timing means good news for improved local traffic flow. We're grouped together with some other vehicles right now and we call that in the traffic engineering world of the platoon. But the goal now is as we're traveling down this corridor down Lindale that this group of vehicles um, we have minimal or no stops. And so the traffic signals are um, in what we call coordinated signal timing where they're synchronizing movements. They're synchronizing our, our southbound movement here from one traffic signal to the next. Traveling south between 82nd Street to 95th Street, we encountered all green lights with only one brief slowdown at 86th Street. Tom also pointed out the use of yellow flashing lights at left turn signals as helping with the flow of traffic. So timing was very good for our commute, but Tom sees a trail of red lights for those who travel faster than the posted speed limit. The speed limit is 35 miles per hour on Lindale Avenue, and that's what our signal timing and, and that synchronization is based upon. So if uh, we were to go 40 or 45 miles a, an hour, we're gonna arrive at the next traffic signal too early. And that traffic signal is probably gonna be red, and so it's gonna add to our delay. So driving the speed limit um, is, is the way to kind of progress through Lindale Avenue. The year-long signal timing project is about halfway through implementation. West Bush Lake Road was the first location, and three more locations will be completed once Lindale Avenue is finalized. We are looking to reduce your delay as much as possible. And motorists can help with improving signal timing too. If you do experience an issue um, from your perspective as you're driving through, uh, knowing the exact time or approximate hour period um, and what day of the week will help us in, in uh, analyzing and seeing if there's anything we need to fine tune. For more information, contact Bloomington's engineering department via the city's website or call 952-563-4870.